Hello friends, this is Nageshwar. Welcome to my channel ITBot143. In this tutorial, I will show how to install print server and how to add printers to the server in Windows Server 2003. To install print server, come to start, administrative tools and please open manage your server. And here, please select add or remove a role next and select print server next and here it is showing install printers for the following clients windows 2000 and windows xp clients only or all windows clients so here i'm using windows 2000 and windows xp clients only so i'm selecting that and next now it is showing add printers to this server using add printer wizard next and welcome to the add printer wizard next and here we have to select local or network printer local printer is directly connected to the server using usb or parallel cable or network printer is connected to the switch or hub using network cable so here i am using local printer i am selecting that and please uncheck this automatically detect and install my plug and play printer if you have the plug and play you can select this otherwise you remove this and next and here we have to select a printer port if you want to use the recommended port so please select this otherwise if you want to create a new port come to here and please select local port lpr port or standard tcp ip port select this and next we came into the tcp ip printer port wizard i want to install use the following lpt port and here it is showing serial ports and parallel ports so i'm selecting recommended printer port next and now here we need to install the printer software here it is showing different printers and here you can find the different printer models so you can select your printer and select your printer model and after that click on next but if you don't find your printer here so if you have the printer drivers just select have disk and here we need to show the installer path so just come to browse computer i have copied my drivers in c drive okay open okay now it is showing the canon lbp 2900 and next and you can type your printer name and please select do you want to use this printer as a default printer Yes or no so i'm selecting yes because this is the first printer i have installing in this server next and if you want to share this printer just give the share name okay i'm defaultly giving it is canon lbp next and here we need to specify the location and comment and this is the optional one but it is better to give location so i'm giving second block and my company it is in r d department next and do you want to print a test page if you want to take a test page please select s yes. or if you don't want to take a printed test page and please select no so here i'm not selecting test page so i'm selecting no and next now it is showing the completing the add printer wizard and here it is showing restart the wizard to add another printer if you want to add another printer for this so please select in this box directly it will start the add printer wizard finish finish 
okay again we came to the add printer wizard so i'm selecting again local printer next and here i'm using create a new port okay i'm using tcp ip port for this printer welcome to the add printer wizard next and here we need to give the printer name or ip address of printer 192.168.0. Okay, and it is showing the port name. Next, okay, now here we need to select the network card so you can find your network cards. So please select your network card and after that if you want to customize please select custom and open settings and here it is showing the port name and printer name and IP address protocol row. I will select standard one and I'm selecting generic network card. Next. Okay finish now we came into the printer software installation and here it is showing the manufacturer so i'm selecting canon and i'm selecting canon lbp 3260 and next and here it is showing the printer name and do you want to use this printer as the default printer no because earlier i have installed one more printer next and it is showing the share name next and location so it is in post block tick support okay next do you want to take a test page no next I'm um, deselecting this and finish it finish it now it is installed the printer server come to start printers and faxes okay and here it is showing the lbp canon lbp 2900 and canon lbp 3260 after installing the printer come to the client system here i'm using windows 7 as my client system so i want to use the shared printer from my server so for that just come to start and devices and printers Please select add a printer. Please select add a network or wireless or Bluetooth printer. And it will show the printers installed on my server. So first I will use Canon LBP 2900. And next select install driver. Installation of software for your Canon LBP2900 is now complete. Okay. And here it is showing the printer name. Next. And if you wish to take a test page, so please select here. But I don't want to take a test page. So finish it. Okay. Now we have successfully added printer from the server. After this, here I want to install a printer in client system and I want to share this printer from client to the server. Now I will install the printer in client system. So come to devices and printers. Again, come to add a printer, add a local printer. Next, how disk. and 
शेयर टू क्लाइंट वन नेक्स्ट ओके एंड फिनिश इट ओके नाउ इट इज इंस्टॉल्ड इन क्लाइंट सिस्टम राइट क्लिक ऑन प्रिंटर प्रॉपर्टीज कम टू शेयरिंग चेंज शेयरिंग ऑप्शंस शेयर दिस प्रिंटर एंड प्लीज सेलेक्ट लिस्ट इन द directory and come to additional drivers and if you want to use this printer in 64 bit computers please select this and install the drivers okay apply okay now it is shared and after that come to the server add printer next please select network printer next find a printer in the directory next find now now it is showing the canon lbp 2900 okay do you want to use this printer as a default printer no completing the add printer wizard finish successfully we have connected to the client system printer after this right click on a printer on server come to properties and here it is showing the general details showing the printer name location where it is installed and come to printing preferences and here it is showing the orientation please select portrait or landscape page order and pages per sheet and come to paper quality so paper source here you can select your paper source tray 1 tray 2 okay and cancel this after that come to the sharing option so it will show the share this printer so list in the directory and again come to the ports and here it is showing the ports available to that printer okay so i have chosen standard tcp ip port so you can add port delete port and configure port and come to advanced option and here it is showing the always available and you can schedule the printer availability so please select available and you can select the time okay and priority if you want to take prints from this printer first so please give the high priority for this printer and after that security so you can give permissions for the users so administrator have the full control and creator owner only manage the documents and everyone able to take the print from this printer and print operators have the full control and server operators have the full control after that come to the device settings and here it is showing the okay default page settings you can select letter tabloid a3 a4 okay now cancel this after that just right click on the white blank area come to server properties and here it is showing the forms forms defines standard sizes to the paper if you want to create a new form just select create a new form and please select metric or english metric it will show in centimeters and english it will show in inches so just give your paper size width and height okay after that just click on okay so but here i'm doing i'm not using this cancel like this we can configure printer server in server 2003 and also we can successfully add our printers to the server in server 2003 if you like this video please click on like button and please share this video with your friends and please visit my channel itbird143 to watch more latest uploaded videos thank you friends have a nice day